Welcome back and happy Thursday. We have a look right now at your cloud cover outside. Not too much happening, most of it offshore, and we have mostly clear skies right now over our region this morning. Talking about those temperatures heading into the 7 o'clock hour, right now we're on the warmer side, but we'll trend down a little bit as those winds start to taper off. You can see some of our inland valleys like Paso Robles could actually be back in the low 40s by 7 o'clock this morning, closer to the upper 40s for solving, and then we have a mix of 50s and 60s along the coast coast and over coastal valley regions. Here's a look at your advisories. We do have a wind advisory in place for San Luis Obispo County through 9 o'clock this morning, as you can see, stretching from the north coast region down to the south coast for San, San Luis Obispo County. And here's a look at that wind forecast. We definitely do stay breezy throughout most of the morning, heading into the end of that advisory, close to 20 mile per hour wind speeds for Morro Bay. And then we'll be breezy for areas like Santa Maria Valley and San Luis Obispo, heading into late this morning and early this afternoon. Here's a look at the wind gust potential. Morro Bay could still hang on to about 25 mile per hour winds through the afternoon hours. San Luis Obispo, 30 miles per hour. Not too bad for Pismo Beach, right around 15 mile per hour wind speeds at their peak, and then 20 miles per hour for Arroyo Grande and Napomo. Talking about these rainfall chances here, it's looking pretty good actually for Friday night into Saturday morning. This is a look at the European model, and we're going to have continued scattered shower activity in the forecast really through Sunday before things start to clear up at the start of next week. However, we will still have cooler temperatures. And here's a look at that rainfall potential for you. A lot of our coastal regions, coastal valleys, should experience about maybe a quarter of an inch up to a half inch of rain over the weekend ahead. That's Friday night through set through Sunday. And then for some of our valley locations, the mountains and foothills, those regions actually could receive up to one inch of rain. Of course, it's something that we'll be continue to, continuing to track here on Daybreak and online at KSBY.com. But here's a look at your daytime highs for this Thursday. You can see mid 80s in Paso Robles, upper 80s in San Luis Obispo, mid 80s in Santa Maria, 79 for Lompoc and 84 for Santa Barbara. So you get the idea. It's going to be another warm day here before these temperatures trend down significantly. In some cases by 20 degrees. Areas that are in the mid 80s today could be in the mid 60s tomorrow. That even goes for places like San Luis Obispo. And you can see upper 80s to low 90s for the Santa Ynez Valley. Five cities region from the upper 70s to the mid 80s. A great day to head to the coast, especially since we are cooling down significantly by Friday. Saturday and Sunday, 79 for Los Osos and daytime highs along the North Coast from those low 70s to the low 80s. I'll send it back to you. 